the YouTube channel for Mania. So today we are doing a speed test comparison of the Galaxy S9 Plus versus the Galaxy S20 Plus. As we all know that the Galaxy S9 Plus now is now a two-year-old flagship from the Samsung and the S20 Plus is the latest from the Samsung. As you all know that the Galaxy S9 Plus comes with Exynos 9810 which is a two-year-old processor but still comes on the Note 9 Lite and all but still a two-year-old processor but the Galaxy S20 Plus have the latest Exynos 990. So guys let's start at so let me start from the boot test itself so let me switch off both the phones at the same time so guys i'm going to switch off both the phones three two one three two one go so after that i am going to turn on both so it's great time guys so i am going to turn on both the ones at the same time it's three Two, one, go. Let's see you. which one opens first. Oh, I think the Galaxy S10 Plus have a slight advantage on the Samsung logo first over there. Come on, Exynos 9810, 990. Oof, a slight advantage for the Exynos 990 over there. A two seconds delay for the Exynos 990. So, so that's a minute catch over there. Then let's go to the basics apps on both. So we are dealing with some basics apps on the both the Galaxy S9 Plus and the S20 Plus. Then in the second row, we are going for the gaming and all. So let me clear all the background apps. So both are having no recently used apps. So this comes with One UI 2.1 and this from the latest updates on the One UI 2.0. So let's. Uh, start off from the contacts actually I uh, have no contacts I will just drop the contacts over there yeah contacts yes I'll put the contacts over there let me turn on the messages yeah contacts so first we'll take the contacts so guys three two one go actually a slight more animation on the uh, Galaxy S10 Plus and uh, this bit S20 Plus feels bit quicker. 3, 2, once again we'll take 3, 2, 1, go. Yeah, actually because of the animation scale and all the... Actually it was almost pretty same. Then go to the messages. 3, 2, 1, go. Actually that was wrong. 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, both neck and neck I think in my opinion. Uh, then let's go back to the camera. So guys, three, two, one, go. Oh, I didn't click on this one. So guys, three, two, one, go. Oh, Galaxy S9 Plus a bit faster. Actually, I will switch the cameras. Yeah, then reverse the back camera itself. Oh, both too nice. Still great performance from the Exynos 9810. Then let's go to the YouTube. So guys, oh, let me turn on the data on this one. Yeah. So guys, you're on YouTube. Three, two, one, go. S20 plus a bit faster. Over there, then we can go to another app uh, for the file manager. So guys, three, two, one, go. Oh, actually, I couldn't say which one is far better. Actually, there is a minute difference between uh, both. Actually, three, again, once again, three, two, one, go. So that's obviously the Galaxy S20 Plus. Then we can again come back to the contacts once again. Three, two, one, go. So that it was a bit quicker on the Galaxy S9 Plus, I think so, in my opinion. However, the animation scale was that three to one go yeah s20 plus was a bit quicker uh, actually the s9 plus have some sort of animations and all so then let's go back to the youtube once again so youtube three in three two one go it was on the background yeah let me that let it remain in the background itself actually then we are going for the x center there is the x center yes there is x center on the bot so guys x center in three two one go yeah, oh, a bit quicker on the 
uh, S20 Plus. Actually, there is no much significant difference. Actually, a slight one second improvement in the Galaxy S20 Plus in real life day to day uses. In, in benchmarks, there will be a lot, but in real life, there is a one second improvement. So, let's go to some other apps like uh, our gaming row. So, let's start off from the uh, GTA San Andreas over there. So, guys, three two one go yes both i think s20 plus a bit quicker then let me take you offline 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 so guys as you guys can see and then i am going for start game on both so guys three two one go oh that was missed on the galaxy s9 plus let me wait a second new game on both three oof. let's wait for another time so actually there are some mismatch going on both so let me take it once again So now it's start game on both as you guys can see now I am correctly perfectly three two one go yes now which one S20 plus uh, over a slight advantage for the S20 plus as you guys can see a minute second yeah a minute second improvement for the Galaxy S20 plus as you guys can see well so this is the perfect timing which I have Applied both actually three times first just when failed. So let's skip both of them. So there is actually in most of the apps we have opened there is always a one second improvement for the S20 plus but uh, you see that this is still a two year old processor but still performs excellent when compared to just a one second improvement on the S20 plus. Yeah same goes over there. Yeah. So great gaming actually just uh, as quick round gaming on the S9 plus Both games were nice, we can just move to another one. Then we have which one apps on the app store we have as well 9 over there. So we can just open that as well 9 on the gaming section. Yeah, as well 9 over here and as well 9 over here. So guys, 3, 2, 1, go. Game blow. Mm, bit advantage for the S9 plus I think so let's wait and find it out so both supposed Dolby Atmos so that's great in sound in both actually the S9 uh, as well 9 have a great ambience of sound when we play games actually Oof. 
<laughs> surprisingly the galaxy s9 plus starts first actually there is a network improvement for the galaxy s9 plus and all actually see you can see guys over here s20 plus have some network issues i think so that's why the galaxy s9 plus was a bit faster let me yeah now the galaxy s20 plus is too so let's start from the play on board so let me pick up like this for much accurate results three two one go play and uh, yeah which one actually we can take the same on both zero san francisco Yes, we can play this one. Or oh, we can play that. Let's see which one actually run out of six. Oh, it's coming from the back now. So, guys, let's start. So, so guys, three, two, one, go. Play anyway. Three, two, one, go. First cup. Three, two, one, go. So guys, the final play, 3, 2, 1, and go. Yes. Same on both. See which one performs. Oh, S9 plus a light bit advantage for the S9 plus. See, 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 see. Oh. So guys, I will show them on the maximum sound. That's on the SMB plus. This is sound box, sound output from the. This is sound output from the S20 plus. This is the sound output from the S20 plus. And this is from the S9 plus. We can go next on both. Then we can go next, we can see which one appears. Wow! Play on both in 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, that's different, bit different in both, oh guys. So still we can see which one appears. Actually, S9 Plus is appearing a bit faster on board, actually, uh... So let's play some games on S10 Plus.
Guys, we are chasing. Come on. Actually, I just really enjoy the sound output from the both the fast guys. Great. Again, one second we can. So that's regarding the speeders between the Galaxy S9 Plus and the Galaxy S20 Plus. Actually, they both perform so great. Actually, uh, actually, when compared to the practical day-to-day -day usage, actually, I think in just or uh, actually in most of the application, just opened a one second advantage for the Galaxy S9 Plus. Sorry, on the Galaxy S20 Plus, but on the gaming row, actually, uh, in in the Asphalt 9, maybe it's on due to the network and don't even network improvement in the Galaxy S9 Plus and all. So there's a slight improvement for in the Asphalt 9 on the Galaxy S9 Plus uh, advantage. But in all the other apps, the S20 Plus have a slight advantage of one second uh, in opening the games. So that's all regarding the speed test comparison between the Galaxy S9 Plus and the Galaxy S20 Plus. So uh, guys, hope you enjoyed. Actually, I make more videos comparing the Galaxy S20 Plus versus the Galaxy S9 Plus. Then I am going to the Note 9 and Note 10 Plus. Obviously, Note 10 Plus. And then I will compare to the OnePlus and Pro and also guys, uh, comment down below guys how you experience. So uh, that's all. Thank you guys. So guys, so let's all wait. Actually, I will oh, I just miss out. Actually, let me do the RAM management too. So guys, actually, I just missed out on that. Okay, so let's open the messages. Yes, both in the memory. Let's open. So not need to open camera. Let's open the my files. Three, two, one, go. Yes, both in the memory. Actually, S9 Plus have 6 GB and uh, Galaxy S20 Plus have 8 GB of RAM. So guys, uh, Play Store. Oh, a slight uh, refresh for the uh, S9 Plus and then uh, contacts 3, 2, 1, go. Yes, contacts is both on the memory of both. Then we have YouTube 3, 2, 1, go. Yes, YouTube in the memory of both. The app we need to look is GTS Andreas whether it keeps on memory or not. And guys, our main thing GTS Andreas in 3, 2, Two, one, go. If it kept the memory on the Galaxy S10 Plus, then it would be awesome. Wow, guys, uh, I, I really enjoyed on both actually. Both uh, there are on the Galaxy S9 Plus and the Galaxy S20 Plus. Both have on memory. Great, guys, see. Perfect. So I am saying that both performs excellent in terms of this. Actually, even if it has 6 GB RAM, then also it still performs great. Actually, the Aswell 9 keeps always refreshing in network due to some uh, network refresh and also it's obvious to have the re network refresh on the uh, Aswell 9 so that's not a matter. So let's uh, go back to, oh, Xcenter is there. So let's go to the Xcenter. Yeah, perfect. Then which one is Aswell 9? Obviously, it will, uh, it will have a network refresh. 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, no. Great. So because we are not at the gaming row, that's why. So network singing, see network status not singing, so that this not have a network refresh. So both all the apps, except a minute on the, just we can uh, see is that almost negligible. Actually the Dolby Atmos is uh, on both are excellent, see. Stereo speakers on both. See, excellent gaming experience. So guys, that's all regarding the speed test between the Galaxy S9 Plus and the Galaxy S20 Plus. So guys, thank you. Stay tuned.